What's up, YouTube? This is Brub52, and welcome back to. Oh, no. Welcome back to Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. In this episode, we're going to be tackling Volvagia, the boss of the Fire Temple. But before we do that, I'm going to stock up on some stuff over here. There's quite a few things in this area. If I can even get over there. Wow, why did that happen? There we go. It's up here. This isn't that important, just like, you know, helpful stuff. There's a fairy in a bottle. Okay, no, I need I'm not gonna sacrifice my big pill, that's for a fourth bottle, so I'm just gonna use it on myself. And the bombs, too. Alright, so that's that. Um, we'll just cut across here. Not gonna matter that much. So let's actually go in and kill Valasia. It's gonna be fun. Alright. Haboosh! We're in the boss room. Oh no, we're trapped here. No lie, this boss is pretty epic. Pretty dang epic. This this boss seems pretty good. Not as not as much as my favorite one. Da -da, da -da 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 -da, but whatever, it's it passes. This is for all the fire temple guys. Okay. So he's gonna come out of here, you gotta smack him with the megatone. And then you gotta gotta, gotta rip, rip rip him apart. Alright. Alright, someone's in the bathroom. Nice. Now, okay, this is the one where he's flying around, so you can just kind of go in a circle, and you will not get hit by him, probably. But he's pretty close. Pretty close. Close, indeed. Close. So close right now. Get back in your hole. Okay, he's going back in. So he should pop up a second time. Yeah, he's doing his normal. Do the thing! Do the killings. No. You gotta be there quick, too. He's not gonna wait around for you. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna not waste his time and do jump attacks. Kill him quicker. It's probably the meteors. Or the boulders, not meteors. Yeah, he's gonna go up there and shake a bunch of boulders down. And you gotta... It, it's easy to stay on the side for this one. Because the boulders don't often... Aren't able to get you unless they clip you as they're coming down. So these boulders are up there, and smashing the ground. Much easier to stay on the side and just kind of scale the perimeter. Or, like, you know, crawl the perimeter. So it should finish soon. Yeah. Okay. So he's gonna do us two of them now. He's gonna try to fool us now. You gotta be, you gotta be waiting for him. See if that's actually the one he's gonna pop out of. He's doing his own. Okay. Yep, he's doing his, doing his fire. Oh, it's close. I'm gonna burn. I'm gonna burn. I'm gonna burn. Ah! Oh, I'm gonna make him touch his tail. Okay, he's going in his hole. You go in your hole, buddy. Okay, this should be three times that he's gonna pop up, and then he'll pop out the real time. This might be just two again. Nope, it's three. Oh, Z-target, please. Really weird. I'm Z-targeting. Okay. Trust me, he's close to being dead, boys. We're gonna get him. He's on his three, three times. He doesn't go past three. So we have boulders again. It's chill. It's chill. <sighs> Trying to be the flawless, if you guys can't tell. Doing good so far. Just don't screw this up for me, Volvagia. Don't do it. I see you up there. I see you. Yeah. Oh, man, those are close to me. I think they start to become heat seeking a little bit. Second time. Okay. Three times. Oh, he does four? I did not know that. I honestly did not know he goes four. This should be it. Yes! We killed him.
Very brutal. Burns alive. There's his dead head, which turns into the piece of heart. Right here. Heart container, I mean. I always say that they're piece of hearts when they're heart containers, so that's... That's ten. We have ten hearts. We're about to set our second row, boys. Okay, sorry, I did, like, edit that part out. My mom walked in. But he didn't miss much. This is the start of the cutscene. We actually have Death Mountain becoming a good now and not a bad. Not all death. Deathy. And the Chamber of the Sages. It's Darudia! My boy. Literally. Thank you, brother. I really appreciate what you did. I thank you on behalf of the entire Goron race. You turned out to be a real man, just as I thought you would. By the way, I, the Wild Junior, turned out to be the Great Sage of Fire. Isn't that funny, brother? Well, this must be what they call destiny. Nothing has made me happier than helping you seal the evil here. Hey, brother, take this. This is a medallion that contains the power of the fire spirits and my friendship. The fire medallion. You receive the fire medallion, Journey awakens as a sage and adds his power to yours. Don't forget, now you and I are true brothers. Okay, so I'm actually gonna I'm actually gonna have to end this episode here. This is very short, seven minutes. Sorry, the next one will be longer. I'm doing them on and off every other day now instead of all every two days. So I will continue this in the next episode. I gotta go on low grocery. So anyways guys, I'm gonna this video if you did, please leave a like, comment, actually guys, see you guys. Sorry guys.